What's going on fellas? You know the drill. Yeah? Today we got Zer Grizz 9th COD 2 montage V high. Don't piss me off. Look at the image. <laughs> Look at the image on the screen. Are you dumb? <laughs> Let's crack it off. <laughs> Bruh. <laughs> <laughs> bruv look at the image on the screen we've got grizz you know mike you know he's uh, grizz the goat he's standing here you know he's got this little flannel shirt on yeah he's got this bottle of beer i don't know what beer that is it might be a bud light it might not be i don't know and he's got a fag you know he's got a little, little fag in his mouth <laughs> fucking hell <laughs> You know, because like when we were doing this thing, yeah, and we were recording, we were little kids, bruv. So like when you see a man that's like a grown man doing this thing, instantly it, it, you, you have to respect your elders, innit? So when you see an older Don doing this thing, I think that's a, a big part of the reason why he's got so much respect and why he was renowned as the GOAT. Because he was old, like he was a man, innit? He was a little bit older than us. So instantly we had that respect. You know if Grizz was like a little nine-year-old kid? Yeah, we would have respected him for his, you know, clips and the things that he did for the community. But you can't help but be like, it's a nine-year-old kid. But because it was a man, it just made it that much better. It was perfect. Fucking Grizz, man. What a guy, bruv. He's got the fag in his mouth. Look at the editing. Look at the fucking editing, bruv. You know, he's doing a little zoom now. <laughs> bruv. This guy is the GOAT. You know, he's put this little filter on. Aye, right, let's look at the stats, man. It's important. So, this ain't even on Grizz's channel. You know, a lot of his old videos, I can't find them on his channel. But thank God. There's this channel here called the Zer Grizz Collection. Yeah. They upload all the old Grizz montages. This one's got 11k views. I bet the older one, the actual original, has got more. Let's give it a like. I'm subscribed. Make sure you subscribe to the Zer Grizz Collection. Bruv, let's get into it, man. The music. Look at it. It's zooming into my man. Fucking Don, bruv. Don't piss me off. <laughs> Let's go. Bang. You know, pulling out the pistol because there's no sprint button and doing spins. Fuck it now. You know, little jump shots. Come on, bruv. Like, this video came out March 30th, 2009. But the actual original upload probably was like, oh, I don't know, 2007, maybe, at the earliest. Come on, bruv. 2007, before guys even ever played COD 4, my mum was hitting, hitting clips. With a car 98k, oh, come on, man. There's no sprint button, bruv. So man's got to pull out the pistol to move a little bit quicker. Nosk. Melee. Or transitions. Yeah, this is the classic map. Look at that. I, did you see that? You see that scope? Don't piss me off. <laughs> Chris, Chris, don't do this. Chris, let's talk about this, man. Let's talk about this. Man did the whole fire transition and the scope. Look at it, look, 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 look. <laughs> Man's got the flames going, you know. That's mental. Oh, that's mental, bruv. And then look at this. Look at this transition. It's like a Matrix vibe. It's absolutely sick, bruv. I rate it. Yeah, no scope on it. Oh taking a piss you know back in the day when we didn't even understand like no scoping kill feeds we didn't know what anything was this is a pioneer he created this culture 
Look, he's hitting no scopes, bruv. This was unheard of. COD 2, bruv. That's why he's the GOAT. He was doing this since we was in nappies, bruv. He's going up the ladder. On this roof, on this map. I love this map so much. Finds the target. Bang. Jumps across the roofs. You know, doing parkour. But also sniping at the same time. It's fucking sick. And you know the editing and everything's so clean. Like this is before editors. This is way before. I can't I, I, like I can't stress it enough how important this montage is. Like he didn't have any blueprint to go off. Do you know what I mean? He didn't have montages to watch and say, "Okay, I'm gonna do that." He he created this himself, and we all kind of took from it and copied. That's why he's the fucking goat. No one can tell me any different. Look, he's on the roof again. What's he gonna do? Jumps down and gets a quick. Is there any fall damage on this game? I'm not sure. It seems like there's not. I love that. It's just so old school. No scope. No scope. Quick scope. Look how simple this game is though. There's nothing really much going on. There's no numbers popping up when you get a kill. There's barely anything going on on the screen. It's almost like hardcore. But I think it's beautiful. Like the only thing I would add is like, yeah, like a little plus five when you get a kill. That's it. It's so simple. There's not too much going on. I love it, man. Fucking hell, look at that sniper. What was that? Fuck, you know, look at that. Look at the editing. <laughs> yeah. Let's pause it there. What was that map called? I can't remember. I love playing it though. Like, even the matchmaking on COD 2 was weird. It was like you had to like host it yourself. If I can remember rightly. I might have to hop on COD 2. Legendary game. It's funny, isn't it? Like, COD 2 is quite legendary. COD 4 is obviously the GOAT. But COD 3, no one ever talks about it. It must have been quite shit. You know, that's the first ever COD I've ever played. COD 3. I was at my mate's house. And he showed me this game. And he was playing online. This is like in 2000 and... I want to say 2007, maybe, and yeah, he was showing me online, and I was playing it, and I was sniping in it, and I was gassed when I got one kill, so that was my first ever taste, the first ever COD game I played, well, yeah, I think it was COD 3, online anyway. Look, ladder store. In t Bro, this is like in 2007 or some shit. He was doing this way before we was. It's crazy, man. The thing I like about Cruz's playstyle is very calm and just chilled, isn't it? It's crazy stuff look at this ah oh, it's beautiful man the stuff he's doing is crazy but he doesn't move erratic and nuts you know like there's different play styles like reaps you know reaps you could argue you know before or after the transition but reaps reaps's play style was very aggressive in your face 
Blackouts was quite aggressive as well. NSL had a more chilled playstyle. Grizz, super chilled. Like, he doesn't look like he's trying that hard. He's not trying to sweat out. He's just very relaxed with it. It's hard to explain it, but if you know, you get it. And I rate it so much. Mad. There's not even any hit markers, bruv. Well, there's a hit marker, but... I don't know, you just... There's no numbers, in it. Oh, ah, ah, ah. That's a classic, bruv. This is like the best map. Pistol out. Headshot. Headshot, headshot. Look, he's getting headshot feeds. You know, moving like on region. Go on. Spin it, spin it, spin it. Bang. Oi. Oi, he's pulled it back. That's fucking sick, isn't it? Iconic. Switching from the pistol to the to the car or whatever this is. This is a car with no scope on it. Mad. What was this map called? It began with a T, I think. I can't remember what it's actually called. Down with a sick. Disturbed. Come on, bruv. Even the music that Grizz used. Like Chevelle. Disturbed. Like, fucking hell. He taught us about so much stuff. You have to respect it. Chevelle. The Red. Stained outside. When I hear these songs, I think of Grizz. So he was a he, he was an early pioneer. He taught us about all this stuff. He gave us the blueprint. Like you have to respect him. You can't, like, come on, bruv. Yeah, I remember this map as well. You know, there's probably only like a handful of maps on this game, but it was so simple. It worked, man. Getting the headshots, bruv. Look at that. You know, back in the day, montages were just about creativity. What can you bring to the table? It wasn't just like, who can get... Oh, that's mad. It wasn't just like, who can get the biggest, craziest kill feed. There was more to it. Look at the creativity. It's amazing. Look at Chinatown. Chinatown, but it's a bit different, isn't it? I can't remember what this map's called, but this is the original Chinatown. You know, I've hit a little 360 collapse off that little that little um, roof there. One of my uh, one of my favourite clips. The end. Yeah, Chris, thanks, mate. You fucking smashed it, bruv. Yeah, you see this video here, Reaps, 12 Years of Mystery. It's about an hour long. Yeah, I might have to do a live stream. I love that. Let's look at the comments, boys. Look, there's a comment from Hex. He said, 828, a hexed plague is me. So he was there, in it. Hex was there from the get-go, from the beginning, you know, playing with Grizz. That's amazing. Got to love the classics. It's funny how you got a double feed at 1 minute 40 and that guy's going, aha. Yeah, it's crazy, isn't it? Now people hit quads and five in ones and no one bats an eyelid. Holy fuck, that's his TV. Yeah, you know this man's TV was about 60 inches. Look at the size of the TV. It's huge, isn't it? The TV's got to be at least 65 inches, hasn't it? That's fucking mad. What, do you, what kind of TV do you lot play on? I play on, on a little small screen. My TV that I actually play on is like... I don't even know. It's tiny. It's like a little monitor. I've got a big TV as well, but I don't play on that. 
back in the day I used to think the bigger the TV the better but uh, I'm not sure about that a smaller TV so you have less to focus on is actually more optimal but yeah let me know is that Zerg Grizz at the start like in 2007 or whenever this came out who was putting pictures of themselves in montages who was doing that no one Grizz like he just did things that no one else did hi don't piss me off bruv fucking Grizz man what a guy big up Mike big up Grizz every time absolute legend guys Leave me a comment. Let me know what you want to see next. Shout out to Grizz. Go and show him some love. Let me know what you want to see next. And until next time, boys. Yeah? Take it easy. I'm out. See you on the next one.